Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking to you about a little adventure that I went on to Bista Village and I spent way too much money <laughs> but I got some really nice stuff and I thought I'd share it with you guys. So without further ado, let's get into so the video. So first things first, I've never been to Bista Village. I didn't even know it existed until one of the ladies at work told me about it but it was the best experience ever. I really 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 enjoyed it. It was amazing it was so good i wish i'd had more money with me because i think you need to be like a multi-millionaire to shop there but i still got some nice things if you guys don't know this bista village is like a big discount like village shop thing and there's like loads of shops there some are designer some are not well actually it's all designer yeah it's all designer shops but it's basically like a big outlet so everything that they have there is like really really reduced in price. I went there with my mum last Friday because I'm just that cool. But I got a few things. So the first thing that I'm going to talk to you guys about is actually something that I didn't even buy from Bista Village. It was a very random item that I got off Amazon. But what happened was I was at Bista Village, I was in a really pretty dress shop, trying on dresses, as you do, and I said to the lady, that I don't usually wear a lot of dresses because I'm just gonna say it, like my legs chafe because I'm a bigger girl, I have big legs, like it just happens. And she basically said that her friend had bought these, she called it a lacy bandeau for your legs because her legs chafed so bad. So she basically bought these off Amazon and what they are, they're like a bra bandeau but for your legs and you basically put them on obviously underneath your dress and it stops your legs from chafing but it also looks pretty as well so I know so I thought I'd give them a try this is what they look like I haven't actually took them out of the packaging yet so this is like first review kind of thing I got them in a tan colour um, they do look a bit darker than I thought they would but I'm not that bothered but yeah like you can see from the picture it basically goes around your thighs if you've got bigger thighs and it just looks pretty and it stops them from chafing so I'm going to open it. I'm not going to put them on obviously um, but I will just show you and let you know what I think. Okay. They feel like really weird. They have a weird smell when they smell funny. It freaks me out a little bit but hey ho. So they look like this at the top here where my fingers are. I don't know if you can see that. It's like, I don't know what you'd call it. Like, rubbery elastic stuff. I guess it's to hold it on your legs. But that's at the top and at the bottom. So, yeah. I think these are definitely going to be worth a try. It's definitely the weirdest thing I've ever bought in my life. But, yeah. And when I was looking at it on Amazon, you can actually get these in all different colours. You can get them in black, in white, nude pink purple yeah like anything so i would definitely give these a try and let you guys know but all the things that i'm going to be showing you in this video i will try and leave a link to them down in the description that's definitely uh solve my problem for next summer wearing dresses <laughs> the next thing that i want to show you guys is another small thing i actually did get this from bista but recently i don't know if you have a tk max near where you are but recently i bought a what I would class as a really nice pair of glasses from TK Maxx and with my glasses I usually get them from Primark because I don't trust myself to buy an expensive pair and they always 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 get scratched on the lenses because I either forget to put them in the case or can't be bothered to put them in the case and then I can't see out of them because they're full of scratches so I thought the next I said to myself the next pair of glasses that I buy that I like I'm going to buy a nice case to keep them in and not scratch them. <laughs> when I was in Bista Village, I bought this little sunglasses case from Kath Kidson. And then, inside, you get a little cloth, obviously, to clean your glasses with. And these are my glasses. I didn't get these from Bista. Like I said, I got these from TK Maxx. They're like this really pretty purple and gold. Um, yeah, I just really like them. And I haven't got any scratches on yet, so. They're my one pair of glasses that I'm trying to keep nice. Okay, next up is one of the bigger things that I brought. I bought two things from this shop, and I love them both. Super dry, woohoo! 
So I'm gonna show you what's inside. Okay, so first up, I wasn't sure about this item and I quite like clothes that are un unusual but not at the same time, if that makes sense. So anyway, the first item that I got from Superdry is really like in your face bright but it is this luminous <laughs> orange hoodie and I actually, I love it. I wore it so much. I got it in the size large. Um, in my defence, I did try in the medium and they felt the large and the medium feel exactly the same apart from the medium was a bit more fitted when I did the jacket up but it was still a comfortable fit and again for me I'm just gonna say for someone that is a bit bigger like has big boobs and you know big hips and stuff sometimes it's a bit harder to find jackets that are comfortable because you have to get a bigger size for it to fit around your bust but then it's too long on your arms and I have really short arms but this jacket fits like a glove it feels amazing um but yeah it's like this luminous orange color it has writing down the one arm that just says super dry athletic and then it has a little logo on the front that says super dry athletic again track and field so yeah it's like i say it's really like obnoxious color um but i just i love it like the quality of stuff like i just as weird as it sounds i love the zips on their clothes because it just just like robust and like just feels like good quality which is why I like super dry because I feel like you get what you paid for so yeah love this jacket then next from super dry I'm really into crop stuff at the minute but not so cropped that it's like right under my boobs just cropped a little bit above my waistline this next thing that I got is not as bright <laughs> it is another hoodie though but it's just this, I don't know what you'd call this, like a tan beige colour, like a biscuit colour. And it's got a hood on it. The reason that I liked this was because where the hood is, it has like a little crisscross bit here which just looks a bit different. So I thought, you know, something different. And it's quite light as well. But the only, I got this in a size, what size is this? Medium. got this in a medium. But the arms are a little bit long on me, so I have to roll them up two times. Cuffs aren't that big, but I do have to roll them up twice. But I like that look on stuff anyway, so I wasn't really that bothered. I don't know if you can see, but at the bottom it's got this cut-off material. And I quite like I quite like the sun clothes at the minute where it looks like they've just gone at it with scissors and just chopped away at it. Um, but it's just like very frail and I just think it looks cool. Something different, something cool. So yeah, that was the second hoodie that I got and I love it. Okay guys, so another thing that I was really excited about was getting a pair of nice shoes slash trainers, whatever I could find. And the first place that I saw was a trainer shop and I was like, I need to go in here. So that place was New Balance and I was really excited to go in here because I've seen so many people wear these trainers, not these exact ones that I got, but the brand New Balance. I've seen so many people wear them and they look so comfortable. So I just bit the bullet and I bought myself a pair of shoes and I absolutely love them. But these are the bad boys. <laughs> these are the trainers that I got from New Balance. They are a dark blue. I don't know if you're picking me up really well on camera. But they're a dark blue and then they've got jersey grey material on the top, which I really like. And inside is my favourite part. It's like fleecy material inside the trainer and I absolutely love it. They're so comfy to wear and they keep my feet like nice and toasty because it's fleecy inside but yeah i really like these trainers and i'm so glad that i got them because these aren't the kind of shoes that i would normally buy but i'm glad that i did so guys last but not least this is a shop that i've always wanted to go to i've always wanted to shop here and i always see people with these bags and i'm like oh, one day i'll shop in there because it's it is it is not a cheap shop you know it's really it's really expensive and i'm very lucky to be able to have gone to vista and to be able to buy these things but the shop is the white company oh my god i'm so excited and the thing that i got from here i actually tried it on at the start when we went to vista village and then i wasn't 100 percent sure about it 
and then we walked around and it was still there before we were going to leave and I said to my mum I said I just need to buy it because I'm like drawn towards it and I keep looking at it so I might as well just get it. So guys the thing that I got from the white company was this beautiful jumper. I absolutely love this jumper you guys. I think it's absolutely beautiful. I'll try and get a close up of it but it's 100% cashmere like oh I just love it. It's so soft. This is going to be my winter jumper because it's a it's not long long on me but it's long enough that it almost covers my bum so I could wear it with like you know leggings and boots and thick tights and or a skirt maybe I don't know but it's this really pretty charcoal grey colour and it's got a v-neck neck and then I did roll the sleeves up at the end just because I love to roll sleeves up on stuff and I just think it looks that bit more cute so I'll try and show you up close but it's like a charcoal grey colour and then woven through it is like blacks and silvers and oh it's just beautiful and it's so soft so soft yeah I just this is like my favourite thing that I got it just makes me want to curl up on the sofa and just not move all day so yeah I'm really excited to wear this like all Christmas all autumn and it's going to be like my prized possession. So guys, that is everything that I got from my haul at Bista Village. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was only a very short video. And like I said, I will leave a link to all the items in the description down below. But they might not be the prices that I personally paid for them. But apart from the leg bandos, everything else that I got was reduced because it was from Bista Village. So everything that I leave down below it might not be the same price that I paid for it but it's still there for you guys to have a look at if you want to but yeah definitely leave me a comment down below guys and let me know what you thought of this video let me know what you want to see next and please don't forget to like this video give it a big big thumbs up because it would really help me so much guys leave a lovely comment down below let me know what you thought of the video or what you'd like to see next or just say hi follow me on my Instagram my Twitter my snapchat also guys I've got some pretty big news. I don't know if you've seen already because I haven't filmed since Christmas, which is really bad of me. But I do have a job Monday to Friday, so sorry. <laughs> but I hit 20 subscribers. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> um, I know that's not a big thing for a lot of you, and a lot of you watching this, if anyone's watching this, is probably thinking 20 subscribers, that's nothing. Some people that I watch have got like 2 million. Yeah, well. I've only just started and I'm really inconsistent so but I just wanted to say a massive massive thank you to all of you for getting me to 20 subscribers because for a while I was at 18 and then I went to 19 and then I looked this week and I was like oh my god I'm at 20 and for me for a while I've wanted to be at 20 subscribers so to get that number has made me really really happy and it just means it makes me want to push myself more to make more videos for you guys so I think my new schedule is going to be every weekend to film something because like I say I do work Monday to Friday so hopefully I can get that up for you guys but I just want to say a big massive thank you you have no idea how happy it makes me so yeah, hopefully, fingers crossed, subscribers keep growing. But yeah, thank you so much for watching my video, guys. Don't forget to give a big, big, big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below, either saying hi, let me know what you want to see next, what you did like, what you didn't like about the video. If you're going to buy any of this stuff, <laughs> let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media. Links are down below. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye everyone!